Yo, what's going on guys? Today's video is going to be on 97 overall future star Sixto Sanchez. Now, we all know Sixto already has a prospect series card, but he is a low tier diamond. So they actually just came out with this card about a week ago um, for a headliners pack, and it is a 97 overall. Um, I'm definitely decently excited to try him. I would say pretty excited, being the fact that I am a Marlins fan. And uh, I have high hopes for Sixto when he does come up with the Marlins and whenever baseball returns. Um, nonetheless, though, I'm pretty excited to try this card. Let's look at his uh, attributes, though. So he's got 94 stamina, which isn't the best, but it isn't terrible either. 97 hit per 9, 90 K per 9, 99 walk per 9, uh, and 88 control. So the dude has very very good uh, per nines when it comes to um, control and walk per nine so he should be able to dot up pitches pretty well uh, but we all know how this game goes when it comes to pitching um, he does have 99 velo on this card so that is pretty good he's going to throw gas uh, let's look at the pitches real quick he's got four pitches sinker at 95 Circle change at 81, 99 on his four seam, so that's maxed out, and a slider at 88. His quirks, he does have pressure cooker, workhorse, stingy, untouchable, control artist, grounded, cheesy sinker baller, and illusionist. He does not have outlier on his primary pitch, which is a sinker, which is kind of weird, uh, being the fact that he does have that 99 velocity and we have seen cars that with 99 velocity do have the outlier quirk on their primary pitch but Sixto does not so he's going to be throwing that sinker around 95 to 97 maybe bump it up to 98 a few times um, anyways guys as always make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't hit it do so turn those notifications on we're on the road to 8k we're almost there uh, so you know we're almost at 7.6, so just a little bit over 400 to get to that 8K mark. Um, make sure you leave a like on the video, and if, as always, uh, leave your questions in the comment section below, and I'll try to answer them as quickly as possible, all right? Now let's get to this gameplay. All right, guys, today's opponent for Sixto's debut is going to be Wood Streamer. He's going to have Howe Newhauser on the mound, and uh, he's going to have his cap leading off, Springer, Mickey, Gary, Chipper, Biggio, Gorman, and Correa. So he has quite a bit of righties, which is going to be good for Sixto in his debut. Don't want to face too many lefties, but he's got half and half, so at least he's got four righties to face. Um, so we're going to go to the top of the first. I'm away. I had Mickey get on on a walk. With two outs. I hit that uh, changeup early squared up into the right or left center field gap for a nice little double that's going to bring Mickey all the way around. Easy run right there with uh, Mickey having 95 speed. We take a nice little 1-0 lead. And uh, we'll turn it over to the bottom of the first. We don't score anymore. <clears throat> and we right away, oh, oh, count, give up a single up the middle on a sinker but no, beneath the zone to his cap. Uh, but he hits it pretty well, so he gets it up the middle. Now we got a 3-2 count to Springer. We throw the change up low and away. It's going to be strike three for Sixto's first strikeout of his uh, debut. And now we got Mickey up. We try O oh, sinker middle away. We kind of leave it over the middle. Luckily, my opponent gets under it enough to where it's only a fly out to the shortstop. But that could have been pretty bad, being the fact that uh, that was pretty much down the middle. All right, now we got uh, Gary coming up for him with a one-one count. We're gonna try that slider or off. Sorry, change up low and away. He actually hits it right back up the middle. Finds a hole. Doesn't hit it very hard, but he does find a hole for a base hit. And now we got Chipper coming up. With a 1-0 count, I try to change up low and in. I hit my meter pretty well, but it stays a little bit hanging, and he gets a hold of it to right field for a tank with Chipper. I mean, if you hit the ball well with Chipper, he's going to hit it out pretty much every time. Now it's 3-1, to one, so we're kind of in a hole. Uh, we're trying to get out of this inning. Um, with two outs to Biggio, we get the sinker middle away. He gets under it completely, hits a nice... Fly, easy fly out to right field to end the inning so we do a little bit of damage control yeah we give up three but we get out of the inning with no more runs allowed uh, I don't score at all in the second so we'll turn it over to the 
bottom of the second since it is a 6-0 debut and that's what we're focusing on. Try that sinker middle in first pitch. He checks swings and hits it to the first baseman for an easy out with Gorman. Now we got Correa coming up. 1-1 count. Try the fastball in on his hands off the plate and it gets him to chasing easy jam fly out to the second baseman. Two quick outs. Very good uh, start to this inning. Now his pitcher's up with the 0-2 count. We're looking for the K right here. We're going to try off speed and we miss our meter, and it's completely beneath his own, but he swings through it for strike three. That's Sixto's second strikeout. Nice little recover inning right there for Sixto. And uh, now we got Mickey coming up, leading off the inning with a 1-0 count. He throws a sweeping curve low in the middle of the plate, something we can handle. We hit it for a base hit through the six hole, and now we are threatening with Mickey, or uh, er, threatening with the first guy up. Sorry, with the first guy on. Now I get out with Thames, so bring up... Uh, Chipper, who gets a fast two-seam fastball middle away, and uh, we hit it up against the, off the wall. Unfortunately, I don't score because I didn't want to send Mickey. I wasn't too sure if uh, that was actually going to drop or anything like that. Now, Gary gets walked, and now uh, Jose Ramirez comes up, and we score two runs off the very early hit. I got fortunate that I got the hit down the line and it wasn't a foul ball. I did get lucky on that part. So we get the two runs back. We're tied now. And I don't know what I was doing. Like, I could, like I don't know what I was doing trying to go to second, back to first. I don't know why he went to second in the first place, but he gets me out. So now there's two outs in the inning. But Zobris comes up, gets a changeup he can handle, hits it for a perfect, perfect fly ball. And now we are up 5-3 to three at the end of the top of the third. Oops, fucking sorry, baby. <clears throat> so now we got... Uh, his cap leading off the inning with a 3-2 count. We try a fastball low and in. We get him We get him uh, late on the pitch and under it. Easy fly out to left. Good start to the inning. First batter's out of the inning. Now we try a change up low and away. Underneath the zone. He check swings, but they call him out. Strike three. His third strikeout now to George. Third strikeout of the game. Second to George Springer. And now Mickey's up for him. We try the fastball above the zone. We get him chasing for strike three. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. That's four Ks now. And uh, we'll go to the top of the fourth when my cap leads off the inning. I hit one good, good, but Gary chases it down. I thought it was going to get over his head or off the wall, but it doesn't, unfor unfortunately. Um, but it is what it is. We'll move on to Mickey's at bat. Mickey gets a O, oh, sweeping curve again. This time it's right down the middle, hanging, and we hit it out of here. We don't forgive him. Oops, fucking sorry. And you know what we say. Hey, Mickey, you so fine. You so fine. You blow my mind. Hey, Mickey. Hey, 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 Mickey. So now we turn over to the bottom of the fourth. We don't score the rest of the inning. And uh, we throw the slider right over the middle. But luckily, he was not looking for that pitch. He was looking for something hard. And he get, we get him chasing. That's strike three to Gary Sheffield. Good way to start the inning. Now we got chipper up. We get uh, first pitch strike on the changeup. And now we throw the fastball away off the zone. Get him chasing. Easy fly out to left field. That's two outs in the inning. And... Uh, we're looking good right now with Sixto. Sixto's just, you know, coming in, uh, throwing some dots. But, unfortunately, as I say that, on a O oh pitch, I miss with a slider over the middle to Biggio. And my opponent does not forgive me. He hits a tank on that. And uh, now it's 6-4. to four, So, he's down only by 2. O oh pitch again. We throw one low and away. He gets uh, under it a bit too much easy fly out to center field we are out of the inning one run allowed but you know i don't like to give up runs after uh scoring i mean i don't like to give up runs period but especially after scoring uh we'll go turn it over to the top of the fifth where gary comes up with one out two two count throws a two seamer loan away we get right on it early good into the left center field gap good little double for gary right there and uh, now we got a 3-0 count with two outs to Zobris after Ramirez got out. He walks him. And now Big Springer's up with a 1-0 count versus the lefty. And you know what he does. Perfect, perfect fly ball. Three-run tank with two outs. We are now up 9-4. to four, Give a nice cushion to, to six though to get that dub. We're looking for that dub with him. Oops, fucking sorry, baby. Turn it over to the top. Or sorry, bottom of the fifth um, to Correa with the 3-1 count. We try to slide her middle in. We get it over the pl it goes over the plate, but my opponent's late on it. He probably wasn't expecting slider there, especially in that spot. Uh, so he flies out to right for a nice little routine fly out. One out in the inning. Now he's got yellows coming up. 
we try to sink her down the middle, or not down the middle, slow and away, stays over the middle. But we got, he hits it up the middle, but Sixo is there playing footsies with the ball. He recovers nicely, easy out. That's unfortunate for him. That would have been a base hit if Sixo doesn't play footsies, but, you know, sometimes that happens. All right, so now we got a one-two count. Throw a pitch up and away. My opponent drives it the other way, and George Springer's just out there doing, I don't know what he's doing, to be honest. I thought he was going to get to that. I thought he should have gotten to that, but he doesn't. Fortunately, we get his Springer to ground out on the very next pitch. No damage done. Nice shutdown inning after a three-run inning. So we got a 9-4 lead. Don't score it all on the top of the six. We'll turn it over to the bottom of the six, where I throw a 2-2 fastball middle end to his Mickey. on, uh, And he turns on it really well. That's a tank right there. He squares it up. Very good hit by him. I mean, it was right on the black. Nothing more I can do about that pitch. So now we got a 1-1 count to Gary. I try the fastball up and in. He's laid on it. Easy routine fly out to Jose Ramirez at second. So that's going to be one out in the inning after giving up the tank. Good recovery right there by Sixto. Um, now he's got Chipper coming up with a 2-0 count. We're going to try to sink her low and away. It stays over the middle, but fortunately for me he hits a line out to left field that was a good that was a well hit ball but unfortunately he just finds the glove and not a, and not the grass uh now we got an 0-2 count to craig biggio we try the fastball up and in we miss over the middle and he makes us pay for it that's biggio's second tank of the game turns on that fastball really well that's uh gonna be nine six now and he you know he hit a perfect perfect fly ball nothing more we can i mean he did everything he he needed to do Oh, count though to Gorman. We get him to fly out to left, so we do give up two runs after scoring three. Now he cuts the, the lead back down to three, and uh, well, not after scoring three, we didn't score in the top of six, but we were up five. He cuts it down to three though, so uh, we'll turn over to the top of the seventh, and uh, with a three-two count, he tries to cut her up and up and into Ramirez with Alavino, but we square it up for a nice base hit. Just finds the grass out of the um sorry out of the right fielder's reach we get a two seam fastball middle away to zobris and zobris hits it for a perfect perfect fly ball apo taco oops fucking sorry we're back up by five now uh six those debut was over at that point i mean he gave up six runs in six innings he didn't do the best but he didn't do the worst he gave us a chance to win the game that's that's all we can ask for uh he, my opponent doesn't score in the bottom seven. We turn it over to the top of the eighth. We get a fork ball down the middle of Thames, and Thames hits it for a perfect, perfect fly ball. Oops, fucking sorry. He does not forgive that pitch right there. Then with the 0-2 count, he tries a fastball over the middle to Chipper, and Chipper also hits it for a back-to-back. -back. Oops, fucking sorry. Now we're up 13-6, and we're looking good right now. So top of the eighth. We're still in the top of the eighth. We turn it over to Ramirez after Gary Sheffield gets out. 0 2 Cal. He throws a sinker down in, pretty dotted right on the black, but we get to it perfectly. Good, good right there, right on that pitch for another tank in the inning. Oops, fucking sorry. Up 14 to 6 now. And uh, we're looking good. We got a nice eight run lead going to the bottom eighth. We bring in Ottavino. We get the first guy out. We turn it over, or we go to Gary Sheffield's at bat for him. And uh, he gets a base hit with Sheffield up the middle. And then Chipper comes up next with a 0-1 count. I missed my fast I missed the pit. I missed my location. Leave the fastball in the middle and Chipper hits it in the gap for a perfect, perfect liner. And that's gonna score Gary. Uh, so now he's down seven. So we gotta try to get out this inning, get out the inning, which we do. So we'll turn it over to the top of the ninth where he brings in Gossage versus Mickey. First bat of the inning. Nice little base hit on a sinker low middle away good good poke it through the six hole that's just good hitting right there we end up walking with chipper uh so we got first and second thames did get out so we got first second three one count to gary he throws a slurve but he completely hangs it and i sit back on it and hit it for a three run tank oops fucking sorry we are now up 17 to 7 uh it's not gonna be a mercy obviously it's in the ninth inning but we got a nice lead six is looking to get that dub and all we gotta do is just close it out. Don't you know? Don't have a crazy inning. He, as long as he doesn't have a crazy inning, Sixo gets that W. Uh, so as you can see, we get the first batter out in the inning. Now um, Mike Trout comes up with the O count. I throw a uh, cutter low and in. I kind of missed my spot a little bit. Actually, I mean, 
you could say I missed it a little bit, but it wasn't a terrible pitch. He turns on it for a tank. That's a great hit by my opponent. So next bat in the inning, we strike him on us, two-seamer, low and in. He just stares at it. And uh, Springer now comes up with a oh count. We throw the fastball over the middle, but he gets on top of it. Easy roll over to the third baseman. That's the end of the ball game. Sixo gets the W, 17-8. Uh, nice, I wouldn't say the best debut, but it wasn't the worst debut. He gets the W. Um, I will say about Sixto, I don't think he's going to be very usable. Uh especially against good players. You could probably sneak him in on Legend, but I don't think... He's not going to be in my rotation, personally. Um, I don't know. I just don't think that his pitches are that overwhelming where he can consistently get out. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the video. And uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you haven't, we're on the road to 8K. We're almost at 7.7K now. So um, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn the notifications on. Leave a like on the video. And as always, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below and I'll answer them as quickly as possible, right? I hope you guys enjoyed the video and until the next video, peace.